this is Feeba Podcast. Thank you for joining us in our morning daily devotion. Greetings to you in the most precious name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Let's meditate on relationships today. God blesses each one of us with beautiful relationships. Analyzing their responsibilities and discernment of God's will about them is crucial as some would be worldly and could be out of our own will. The understanding of God's will comes from hearing and listening to Holy Spirit. God's love triggers a relationship to be built, strengthened and sustained. It brings in unconditionality, incomprehensible love, forgiveness and shunning off the works of flesh. Efforts of love, patience and kindness take the lead till they breathe their last. God expects the absence of self-centeredness absolutely and presence of sacrificial nature all through the span of relations. Giving up on these relationships shouldn't arise in the heart of a believer. When we keep ourselves pure in the sight of God, we tend to see others with God's eyes. Henceforth, we receive God's mind and start to love them as he does. Therefore there would be a paradigm shift in our thinking and rationalizing of things and people eventually we bring glory to God above loving and doing good are the prime factors to nurture a relationship and to carry out responsibilities we also need to stir up others and encourage them to do this is how the sweet smelling aroma is spread which Christ expects Each moment a believer needs to be extremely conscious that he or she doesn't belong to the world but God. Enemy wants us to refrain from relationships if bitterness persists, but the word of God encourages us to meet and exhort one another as we wait for Lord's coming according to Hebrews 10th chapter. The more we rejoice in the Lord, we enjoy our relationships and gentleness would be fragrance in it. As we involve ourselves always in prayer and thanksgiving we would be less anxious about the things thereby peace reigns in our hearts giving us deeper perception the meditation of word strengthens our hearts and enhances god's presence let's be kind to each other tender hearted forgiving one another as god forgave us let's bring out only good when we speak which edifies and imparts grace to hear us let no corruptness proceed from us which would grieve holy spirit our communication has to be swift to hear and slow to speak let our words be full of grace and with the anointment of holy spirit which produces the righteousness of god for this one need to be equipped and rooted in god's word a believer is ought to be a hearer and doer of the word continually and therefore will be blessed and be a blessing loving others is a driving force for a christian believer love pays attention provides for needs and gives emotional support we must be able to see others pain though we go through ours we have to practice the attitude of meeting others needs though ours aren't met let's always remember that jesus truly cares for our needs provides us and attends to our pain as we grow in spirit let's enable god to work out beautiful bonding relationships for all of us on this earthly pursuit it's the third word on the cross jesus said to his mother woman this is your son then he said to the disciple this is your mother john 1926-27 let us pray Gracious Lord heavenly father thank you Jesus for this beautiful meditation Lord thank you Lord for being with each one of us at this moment of oh, father Lord I praise you for whoever is listening to this of oh, father thank you Jesus Lord bless each one of us with our relationships of oh, father Lord you have which you have given us of oh, father fill us with your love Help us to humble down, empower us with your spirit and give us grace to carry out our responsibilities, O Lord. Thank you, Jesus, once again. I ask these words in the most precious name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Dear listener, we are here to stand with you in your time of need. 
we want to pray with you and for your prayer request. Do you need someone to talk to? We are here for you. Call us or send a message at plus nine one six three six four two five two one six four plus nine one six three six four two five two one six four. God bless you. Thank you.